Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to a brand new video and welcome back to the channel. Today we've got something completely different. Well, so, you know, somewhat different. We're going to be opening up a Pokemon card box right here. We've got the ETB of the Shining Face, which is the Elite Trainer box. This set just came out and it's in really high demand. It's sold out everywhere. I bought this to resell, but I figured I would actually open it and uh, just see what we can get inside and make some good content for the channel. Like I said, it's a bit different. I'm more into the, the Supreme and the sneakers and the streetwear than... The collectibles but there is a crossover between the two like audiences so i figured we'd see what you guys think of opening up the pokemon cards maybe like basketball cards or other stuff in the future if you guys don't like it then we won't do more and i don't know we'll just see it's an experiment this is one of the most sought after things at the moment in pokemon it's sold out everywhere it's reselling for profit so if i did want to resell this i actually could which go ahead and open it all up now we've got a bit of a setup going with with all the camera to show the cards i'm not like particularly familiar with this but we'll try our best the, the ring light is kind of throwing things off but i do have like a, a camera here i just can't fit the whole box in but yeah we go ahead and open it up it comes with a bunch of things inside but the main thing we're looking for is these 10 booster packs right here we're going to be opening all these up today it comes with a, a bunch of i guess energy cards right there's like loads of these and there's so much going on on the desk i don't know what i'm doing all right here we go so first off it comes with this uh this promo card this ev v max card this is just yeah a promo you get in every single box i'm not sure how much this is worth i assume they all typically come in good condition brand new i'm going to keep this in the packaging i feel like it makes more sense to keep it in the packaging than take it out and then put it in a sleeve right because this is literally just completely sealed but yeah we got that ev v max See, i'm going to be looking down at the cards here I don't, I don't know if like the face cam is in a good place it probably isn't but you know we're learning but like i say the main thing we got right now is the 10 shining face packs all of these booster packs we're going to be opening up and there's potential for this card right here which is the shiny charizard and this is actually worth like 600 pound i think raw which is just unbelievable so if we pull that today oh my god there'll be some serious scenes but yeah before we get into those it comes with some sleeves which i do actually need you obviously want um sleeves so we'll go ahead and get those out and yeah they just comes with you know a bunch of sleeves which like i say being a, a new person to well not a new person's pokemon obviously honestly my, my childhood was full of pokemon bro playing all the games playing the cards i had so many of the old cards when i was younger and I sold them all on eBay when I was still young and they weren't worth a lot of money. And they would be worth like thousands nowadays, like all the EXs and stuff back in the day. Man, I, I definitely made a huge mistake selling those when I was younger. But you know, nonetheless, we're going to go ahead and open these packs up, man. Um, this is very nostalgic because like I say, childhood for me. This is like seriously childhood. I hope I can keep this on camera well enough for you guys. I'm doing a really good job of opening this first pack up um but yeah there'll be some serious nostalgia in here man i used to open pokemon cards like all the time when i was a kid play all the games and everything i know there's uh something called a card trick where you um can get the best card at the back so i'm going to go through this one normally see how many cards the best one from the back is and then i can do the card trick um from there but i know code card it tell it tells you if this is green or white on the other side it tells you if it's a good pack or not so i'm not going to actually look at that so i'm just going to leave that and then we're just going to go through this pack normally so i don't know snom bro i actually don't know any i know two of these so far coughing and cacnea and then all the new ones i just i don't know snom we got our reverse is a gym trainer so you can see the reverse pattern on the card right there it's shiny um on the outside and that is the reverse which you get one in every pack um i think we want a a shining card in that slot i'm pretty sure um is like the the rare thing but then the, the actual rare so our first one is pretty much like the worst thing you can get is a regular rare trainer that's uh it's just not what you want at all that's literally like the worst thing you can get um as far as a rare goes in a pack so that's good right and it's four cards from the back so th these are all kind of just like bulk so if we go if we take four cards off the back and then the last card will be that rare and we'll do that for the other packs those regular rares are not going in sleeves man um they're literally trash what you want is holographics amazing rares v cards v maxes and then rainbow rares full art trainer card there's actually quite a lot of variations of of rare stuff but uh, let's go ahead and open this one up and if we put um right so if we put the code card to the side turn them all around and we go one two three four this card on the back should be our rarest card and it'll be the last card like i say I, i'm new to this so i really <laughs> i really don't know uh but we're trying our best russ's sword right there rotom and I, I know that as from diamond and pearl my camera's off to the side man i'm i need to do better at this spinner rack that's that's one i know that's from gold and silver all these new ones man i just don't have a clue what they are oh wow we actually got a shiny we actually got a shiny so we've got a shiny tutel right there which is actually you can see these stars right here and 
a shiny Pokemon, if you don't know, is one that is like a different color to his regular one, and it's really rare in the game. It's like one in four thousand odds to find one. Um, so we got a really rare. Well, I don't know how rare. There's a lot of shiny ones in this set. That's why it's called Shining Fates, and it's like a really sought after and shiny Pokemon are really sought after. Um, but yeah, we at least we at least got a shiny right there, and then we actually got a V card in this one as well. So um, De Delamai's V by the looks of things. So we did actually, oh man, I need to try and do better at keeping this on camera. I'm sorry, guys. But Delamai's V right there. So we got a shiny and a V in, in one pack. So that's actually a really good pack. As far as making money and profitability goes, that's actually probably a profitable pack, which you don't find uh, too much in Pokemon. That's for sure. We have a shiny card and a V card. So that is, that's decent. That's actually like the worst V card you can get because there's like V maxes and then there's rainbows and full arts and stuff like that. Uh, but at least we got a V. That's better than nothing. So second pack in, and uh, we're not doing too bad at all. Let's go ahead and open the next one up. But yeah, this whole box was fifty-two pound, um, and it's reselling for around ninety, uh, between eighty-five and ninety. And the reason most people want these is just for the packs. You get a bunch of stuff inside, which is good as well, um, like the sleeves and the EV and uh, other stuff like that. But the main thing people want is the is the packs. So it works out around like eight or nine pound a pack, which is just a crazy amount of money, really, when retail for a pack should be like five pound. Um, I think I did this card trick right, and I'm already messing up. So let's just go through these. We're already getting so many duplicates. Like I've seen, I feel like I've seen it there. Sorry guys, my uh my my phone stopped recording. So uh, but the only good thing we got there was was that, um, and that's not even good. That's guaranteed. It's a reverse holo. Um, but anyway, on to the next pack. So we've only had really one reasonably good pack out of three so far. So we do need to kind of get this to pick up. I'm really hoping we get something like a, a VMAX. Um, oh man, I saw the color of that card. I think that was a white, so I think that means it's good. But we're looking for like a rainbow rare, really. That's kind of what we need. Otherwise, there'll be nothing really like worth opening in this box. You need something like a, a rainbow or a amazing rare. Or something like that because um if you just get a v max uh a regular v card it's not really great at all cacnea again our reverse it is a luxio uncommon and then oh no it was it was a green cone card green code card so regular rare these are the, these are the bane of our lives man we do not want regular rares they are absolutely trash that's literally like the worst thing you can get in a pack so not great so far uh three regular rares out of Four packs. That is, that's pretty terrible. Let's see if we can actually get anything decent out of this one. It doesn't look like it because I don't see any colors back there, unfortunately. Uh, I, I never really get any good kind of pack luck in, in these kind of things. I play CSGO and you open like cases and I just never get good stuff. We'll see if we can turn it round. Okay, we've got a reverse EV. That's honestly like a pretty cool picture right there even though it's a common card and then another regular rare oh my god we got four out of five packs it's a regular rare i'm gonna start getting annoyed if we just pull absolute garbage from this box i didn't sign up for it i could have just sold this and made like 40 pounds we're five packs down five to go and we have four regular rares to our name pretty good stuff pretty good oh i'm making an absolute mess of this pack i don't care because it's gonna be a regular rare inside of it and it doesn't even matter code card to the side and four from the back well i'm getting quite efficient at this now let's go let's go right these are all the boring cards no one wants to see them Come off to the side oh my god okay okay so this i i was not expecting this to be a I'm shot for words, I'm lost. Um, I didn't think this was going to be like a VMAX or something because it wasn't the last card. But it's a, it's a shiny... Is it a full art VMAX? A shiny VMAX? This this has to be worth a lot of money, man. Toxtricity, I think it's a new one. Um, but wow, I can't believe we actually pulled that. That's that's uh, I was taken aback from that. That's amazing. Um, so it's a shiny Toxtricity VMAX. I, I don't know if that's a full art. I can't, I'm not great at determining the full arts. Um, but then we got a, re a regular rare, but we don't care about that, man. I think the fact that it's shiny, it put it in the reverse slot. But look at that card. That's, 
that's amazing so that's actually an unbelievable pull i'm going to be really careful with this and we'll put it in a sleeve but man that's um that's really good i might be overreacting it might not be like amazing like it might not be as unbelievable as i think but that is actually so sick i think that's like a really good pull i'm gassed off that not only is it a shiny card like the um like the the tutor that we had here it's not just a v card it's a v max shiny so man that, that must be really good i'm i'm pleased with that for sure that's probably going to be the best pull of our box unless we get like the charizard the charizard but that's unlikely so i mean we'll take that for sure okay that, that picked up we started the second half right let's see if we can continue with a good second half of the box i know with those kind of cards you get them graded and like the centering and stuff it all matters that looked good to me but look i don't really know like you know about the centering of cards and what is good what is not uh we'll take four cards off the back here continue the opening right well i gotta sort all these cards out there's falling about everywhere oh my god we got another shiny we got, we got another shiny. Uh, see, I don't know how rare they are in this set. That's the only thing. I feel like you probably get quite a few shining cards because it's literally called uh, Shining Fates. So we got shiny Galarian Weezing right there. That's actually sick. And then our, our actual rare card is a regular rare Manaphy. Uh, do they do hollows in this set? I don't know if they do hollows in this set. So I know you can get rare hollows and regular rares, but it looks like maybe they just do regular rares and then they got all the, like, the V cards and stuff and the shinies um, rather than having hollow rares i might be wrong on that but i've not got a single hollow rare out of six packs so far so we've got four left um, i hope you guys are enjoying this man it is very different from my regular content but um like i say that there is a pretty significant crossover especially since um like logan paul did all the pokemon stuff and it started blowing up collectibles started blowing up um there is a pretty significant crossover like i say between sneakerheads and people that collect cards and then this is obviously like childhood man pokemon cards are, are what i lived for as a kid so it's um so it's just cool to be able to do it again and then share it on the channel with you guys and then yeah hopefully you guys are enjoying it these these like regular cards like i honestly couldn't care less about they were just going to the side absolutely chilling i'll uh i'll pick them all up in a second oh my god we got we got another shiny v so we got a phalanx phalanx v shiny card wow so it's not a v max so it's not um not quite as good as this toxic toxicity um which i think is also a full art but i don't want to say that because i might be wrong but we got a shiny v card right there a phalanx v and then we got oh we did get a holographic so that's good um they do have holographics in this set a holographic rillaboom so you see the the shiny pattern behind the picture right there that's a, a holographic rare which we actually finally got one and then we got the the shiny phalanx so that, again, very good pack, man. Very good pack for sure. We'll go ahead and chuck it into a sleeve. Make sure it's all nice and secured. There's so, so many common cards. It's so funny because you get all of these cards and, like, just no one cares about them. You might as well just get, like, two cards in the pack rather than all this bulk. But, I mean, I guess, like, for the, the kids that play the game and stuff like that, that's why you get all of these common cards but literally like look at how many cards we've opened up right there and then the good ones are just to the side but it's just so many it's it's unbelievable okay and that's um oh man we only have we only have two packs left that's actually so sad my uh my hope of getting a charizard is running pretty low and the, the odds of getting that Char charizard are actually like ri ridiculously low i'm pretty sure um however this toxicity is probably the same um kind of re uh like you were, you got the same chance of getting this toxicity v max shiny as you do of getting the charizard so this is just as rare uh but it's not a charizard so it's not worth like the insane amount i'm pretty sure anyway but yeah that, that's actually this card right here so it's, it's one of the the artworks on the packs so we got two packs left man two packs left i don't know it's quite exciting it's it's making me uh like i'm enjoying this honestly i never thought i would enjoy opening up pokemon cards again after being a kid but um i i am enjoying this it, it's honestly good oh man i looked at the back of it oh i do i do see something you know it's uh it's not all yellow back there so there's some kind of a v in there at least i don't want to spoil it so we'll do the one two three four and it definitely is <laughs> 
Let's go. I, I didn't want to spoil that, but I, I saw it and I couldn't not say it. But we got something good at the back of this pack for sure. Yanma, Trap Inch. Oh, I haven't actually seen that one yet, have I? Shinx. I feel like I've got more cards in this pack that I've not seen than I have for the rest of them. Um, let's see what we're getting. So the reverse. So it's not the Charizard because the Charizard would be in this slot because it's shiny. But we got reverse Rotom, which is uncommon. And our V is a Ditto V. Okay, cool. So it's just a. A regular V, it's not like a V Max or a Shiny or anything. Regular V card, but it's a Ditto. Really cool Pokemon, one of the original ones, of course. So, you know, can't be too mad at that at all. That's uh, it's good to get another V rather than a regular Rare. And we have one pack left. One pack left. Let's see if we can get the Charizard in the final, in the final pack. I want to try and avoid seeing any kind of colours on the side. So we're just going to not even look at it. We're going to get it all organize take the card off the back i didn't mean to look at the color although i don't know if that actually makes a difference for this set because um some sets it doesn't four cards from the back let's go ahead and see what we get in this final pack so float soul team yell tau tropius not seen that one before i've got so many of this card right here it's obviously a common and this one right here as well i've got loads and this one oh my god I'm saying I've got loads of the commons, obviously I've got loads of the commons. Right, coming up to the final couple right here should be our reverse. So, we didn't get another shiny, which is unfortunate, but our reverse is a rusted sword uncommon. And then, ah, oh, it looks like we just got a regular rare as our final card. Man, so we got a lot of regular rares, honestly. Like, we, did, we didn't get good luck in that at all. We got one good card, essentially, and that was that... Um, the VMAX Toxtricity. So I'll quickly go ahead and organize these and we'll go through them. So these are the best cards of the box that we got. Um, obviously, these are all of the, uh, just the reverse hollows that you get one per pack. So they're not particularly rare. Uh, you honestly don't really want to get those. You would rather get a shiny card in that slot. Um, but they're somewhat rare. It looks like there's something in this pack. I'm glad that wasn't the VMAX pack. Anyway, um, Rillaboom. Hollow, uh, hollow rare, you can see in the pattern back there. Uh, we got hollow rare, so that is, you know, not a regular. And then we got two shiny cards. Um, so we got a shiny Galarian Weezing, which has got obviously like the stars here, and it's a different color. So that is good. And then we got a shiny Tutel as well. I'm not sure like what the pull rates are on packs and stuff like that. I'm not sure what the odds are of getting a shiny. If it's one in five packs, then you know we got two, which would make sense. Like I say, I, d I don't know all the all the pull rates. Um, but we got two shiny cards, and then we got two regular V cards, which we got the Delamize, which honestly I can't even really see where, like, the Pokemon is in this picture. Like, what is the actual Pokemon? I, I really do not know. I don't know. But yeah, Delamize V, and then we got a Ditto V, which is which is cool. This is like, these are like the EX cards, basically, back in the day. And yeah, we got, we got a Ditto V right there. And then moving on to the second best card, we got a shiny Phalan Phalanx V. Um, so this is obviously, you know, like a shiny card and a V card, but all in one. So, you know, shiny V card. And then this is definitely the best card that we pulled, which was Toxtricity V Max shiny. Um, like I say, I'm pretty sure this is the same kind of card, like the same type of card as the Charizard. So you're just as likely to pull the Charizard as you are this. So it's kind of a shame that we got this, but also it's good because this essentially saved the box from being a complete dud because we didn't really get anything crazy um besides this so yeah that's essentially all the best things we got in the box and then we got all the bulk as well and then we got obviously the the ev v max which is guaranteed um here is all of our bulk right there so there's a, a bunch of cards and um that is that is everything from the box i hope you guys enjoyed that man let me know what you thought of the video in the comments if you did enjoy it if you lasted this long man i really do appreciate you being here um this is essentially what we came for this uh this v max maybe you guys want to see more in the future let me know uh this is probably going to be a one-off i'm into mostly like the streetwear and the, the the sneakers and stuff but yeah i mean we'll, we'll see how it goes right so like i say leave a like on the video if you did enjoy it and let me know in the comments below if you're into any of these kind of stuff if you like basketball i'm a huge basketball fan so maybe i can do some like basketball packs i don't know just, just there's a huge crossover like i say between people who collect cards and collect sneakers so i've probably said the same thing so many times but anyway man i appreciate being here as always thank you so much and I'll see you in the next one.